Hello, good morning, and welcome to another edition of The Good, The Bad, The Ugly. The Juice Review Show brought to you by the Department of Inhaled Vapors. Now, the juice I want to look at today is rather a special one. Um, the good people at Refuse Vaping have very kindly sent me a bottle of their soon to be released Apollo. Described as a bomb pop flavour. Now, I've got to admit, being a limey, we don't have bomb pop lollies over here, so I had to do a little bit of research to look into what flavours it should be. And I have to admit, it does sound rather, rather nice. Uh, bomb, basically, for the uninitiated, um, a bomb pop lolly is a lime cherry and blue raspberry lollipop. Oh, it's a lollipop. It sounds kind of yummy. Uh, juice today is 6 milligrams. It's a 80 20 VGPG. It's part of their uh, dripping range. That's soon to be added to their dripping range. My weapon of choice today will be the Snow Wolf, and that is got a Mutant X V2 dual core to 0.24 on top. <coughs> Any views or opinions I express during this review are mine and mine alone. And obviously, as I've just stated, I have not paid for this bottle. This bottle has been sent to me for review. Let's have a quick go. Let's have a quick sniff. Ooh. Straight off the bat, the main smell you get is a kind of limey blue raspberry combination. Ooh, that's rather tasty. Hmm. Yeah. That's covered up. Right, I'm going to start off at 70 watts and then we'll have a little play around and see what we get. No, that's 80 watts. Thank you. Right, now 70 watts is equivalent to just over 4 volts. So here we go. Ooh. Oh, that's rather good. Straight off the bat, you get a very mouth watering blue raspberry lime combination. Really does set the taste buds off. Mm. Cherry kind of comes through at the end and just blends in and mixes with everything else. So you got you you kind of got a fruit party going on in your mouth. Oh, it's nice. It really does make the mouth water. Vapor production, as you can see, is superb. Just like the others from their dripping range. Fruit hit, it's it minuscule. There, there is a little bit to let you know you've taken something down, but it's not one that's going to really play havoc if you've got a problem with fruit hit. Oh, that's kind of nice. It sort of hits about three taste zones on your tongue. You get it right at the front, and that's what that's the one I made. Mm. And at the back, of the two areas at the back of the tongue do get hit with it as well. And that's, as it's going in, you can feel the taste, you can feel your tongue coming alive and reacting to it. Oh, that's nice. That's like, as of yet, we haven't got, I haven't got, well, I wasn't given a release date for when this will be added to their dripper range. But I'll be fair, just from that go, I'd recommend anyone who likes a fruity vape to give it a go. Anyone who likes a mouth water and fruity vape, definitely give it a go. I'm going to go up to 80. I'm going to put a little bit more on there because no one likes a dry hit. There we go. Open up the air. Otherwise, there's going to be trouble. <laughs> right. Cool. Ho ho. Oh. Cool. Mm -hmm. And there's that lovely salivating at the end. <laughs> Higher up. The line plays a lot more. Um, cherry's gone down a little bit, but the blueberry, blueberry, talk that me else. The blue raspberry and the lime really come together well. Mm. 
You do get the cherry twang on the end, which does add a nice finish to it. But the lime and the ra blue raspberry are just... Oh, that's really good. <laughs> As you can see, vapor production, yeah, it's a given. Actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go down to 60 watt and see what underpowering it does. Right, that's, well, not underpowering, that's 3.7 volts. Mm. Going down the scale in power, the cherry. The cherry then actually mixes what well, more it makes more better good english it mixes better with the blue raspberry the lime isn't it's kind of a back note then that's kind of the last bit you get so it's a juice you're going to be able to play with depending on what your preferences are of the three flavors whether you want all three in together or two of the others playing with each other so that's good it's got about three different sweet spots depending on your on your fruit preference I can wholeheartedly recommend that. So as I say, I've got no release date on this one yet, but as soon as I get it, I will put it up in the comments for you guys. But definitely keep a lookout for that one when it comes out. Apollo by Refuge Vapen. Absolutely bloody gorgeous. Right, that brings me to the end of this review, guys. Um, thank you for spending the time to watch this. Uh, I, should be be I, 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 I should be back soon with an ability to speak English, hopefully. So I shall see you all later. Bye-bye.